Hello there, lovely people. It's Alex from Nintendo Life here. And you know what? I love Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I really, really do. It's one of the best games I've played on the Switch. I've always been a sucker for Smash, but you know what? That control scheme, it's just its just too functional. Do you know what I mean? It's just too reliable. You know what buttons to press and the thing happens on the screen. I want things to be more obtuse and, more importantly, more difficult. But Alex, how are you going to do that if you haven't seen the title of the video? Well, I will tell you. It is a very simple and very easy method, and it uses this. This is... What is this? This thing right here is the G Bros adapter by 8BitDo, and it is essentially a wireless GameCube controller adapter. Let me give you a nice close up there so you can see it in person. It's a lovely fetching purple color. It's got these buttons along here, which are essentially uh, function buttons, so you can use things like screenshot and home even when you're using a GameCube controller. And quite simply, all it takes is plugging a good old-fashioned GameCube controller, or indeed one of the uh, the new ones that Nintendo has recently re-released, plugging it in, and jobs are good, and you have got yourself a wireless GameCube controller. I'm not entirely certain who this is um, meant to be appealing to. I like it as a little product. I like the, uh, the sort of feel of it and the look of it. But overall, you know, if people are going to be using GameCube controllers for Switch, I imagine they're probably going to want to be doing it wildly. Wiredly runs off two AA batteries. It is a nice little thing. I genuinely really like it, but it's just not as entertaining unless you use one of these. <laughs> because yes, as well as the GameCube controller adapter that you can see here, little GameCube port there, I don't know whether you can see that. On the other side, you have also got, I don't know how you describe that. What is it? It's the uh, uh, Wii, Wii, Wii adapter. Let's get a proper zoom in there so you can really see what's going on. And yeah, that is just that there. And you can just plug in any accessory. And I thought to myself, well, this is mainly going to be used for things like the SNES Mini controllers and stuff like that. And that's how they advertise it. But you know what? I thought this will also plug in. And you know what? It only <laughs> works, doesn't it? All you need to do is just plug this in like this, as though it were a Wii remote. And you are away. You have got a Wii <laughs> You've got a Wii remote nunchuck working on your Nintendo Switch. And I have my suspicions that maybe they realized and wanted to code this specifically because the buttons at the back are A and B. C is A and Z is B. You really can't make this up. So what better game to try this out with than Super Smash Bros Ultimate, obviously. So let's do that. Okay, so here we are. Now I'm on this screen just to prove to you that this is the only controller connected. There's no funny business going on behind or out of shot or anything like that. We've also got this camera set up again so that I can show you the nunchuck being used, um, since that's what the whole video is about. So you might as well have a good shot of it, eh? And uh, yep, this is the only controller connected apart from the Joy-Con on the uh, Switch itself, but it's docked, so what can you do? So we're just gonna dive right back in and play the Super Smash Bros. Um, as you can see, I've got a special name set up with special controls just for this because I, uh, I don't have tap jump turned on, so I need tap jump turned on, or I can't jump. This is the only time tap jump for me is actually useful. So I'm gonna dive in with King DDD because he's the one I know the best. And this is a level 9 CPU, because why not? I'm only going against CPU because I don't want to, um... Oh, it's an incinerator. I don't want to take this online and get absolutely creamed. Or do I? That would actually be quite fun. Especially... Oh, God, imagine if I won. If I chose a character... Oh, God, no. Ah. Uh, if I chose a character, I wasn't, uh, very... Ah! Oh, no, I can't ever... You can't ever get out of that. Right. This is where... Ah! Oh no, I'm gonna need to cancel out! Uh, uh, I can't dodge. I ca oh, I thought I'd knocked him out then. Nearly. Oh my god, I got him! <laughs> I actually got a kill with the nunchuck. That's, um, that's going on my tombstone. I think the nunchuck stick is quite big and has quite a lot of travel, which I'm not expecting. Oh, I'm. I'm doing far better than I ever thought I would, if, if anything proves how little I shield. I dodge a lot, I don't shield a lot, I know I should, uh... Ah, I know I should shield an awful lot more than I do, but I just don't, and that's my way of playing. Come here. Let's see if I can get him off. Can I inhale him? I can inhale him, not that that's any use to anyone, but... 
Ah, you know, it's a thing. No! Well, that was good, wasn't it? <laughs> I'm going online. I'm hoping I don't have any um, compatibility issues because obviously uh, I don't have a plus button or a minus button or anything like that, but it should be okay. Let's just go into... Oh, God, am I going to do a 1v... I'm going to have to do a 1v1, aren't I? I'm not very good at 1v1s, um, especially when I'm using the nunchuck. But we'll have a go, eh? We'll have a go. Uh, make sure preferred rules are set like that. Yep. So let's go into solo, eh? Oh, this is gonna be exciting. I'm gonna play as uh, I'm gonna play as King DDD again because I think he's he's gonna give me my best chance to win, which is what I want to do. I really want to win. Oh God, we found someone. I need to keep remembering that Z is B. I keep pressing C. I don't know why. That's inkling. Oh, this could go exceedingly terribly right now, but it's going to be all the better for it. Ah! This person... I hope you I hope Colin sees this video, because that would be excellent. But I, I, I sincerely doubt they ever will. That's not what I wanted to do, but that went quite well. Ah! It is working, though. It is working. And this is... I am playing Super Smash Bros. online. I'm not trying to inhale him. I'm trying to... <laughs> I'm playing Super Smash Bros. online, and I'm not doing nearly as terribly as I thought I would be. This, that's not what I wanted to do, but it seems to be working. Maybe the, the fact that my behavior is completely erratic is actually an advantage in a way. I don't think so, but... Oh, I've done it again. I've done it again. It's too specific. Because you, you just gotta... Ah! Oh, I don't want to have to mash out of that too often. Oh, I'm not gonna win! I'm not gonna win anymore, am I? I don't think I was going to win in the first place, but it was nice to pretend for a bit. No! No! Ah! Oh no, it's three lives, isn't it? I'm used to playing two. Ah! ah. Still not going to win. I've got to get a stock up on him. And that's just not going to happen when I can't even shield or dodge! No! God, no! Colin, please understand. I'm using this. I'm not doing a rematch but I feel like I want at least a chance to win. My, my, my global smash power is going to go down, so that's something at least. Should I stick with DDD? Oh, let's have a bit of variety. Who else am I good with? I don't think I'm going to be any good with Ridley. Oh, no. Uh, actually, I think King K. Rule might be a good idea because his recovery is very simple. You just press up B once and then you've got really good control. So I'm hoping that will give me Really good control. Here we go. I'm <laughs> going into the lion's den. And it's up against Ridley. Arbrush. Ar Arbush. Arbush. Hello there. I hope this doesn't go too terribly. I can't shield. I can't shield. If you want, if... Ah! I this. I'm so restricted. It's... Infuriating, I can't. I can't dodge, I can't. I'm just walking right into it. Because I can't do anything else. I'm just gonna throw my crown until it's. until it's over. I can't shield that! Ooh, that was a decent hit. If I get one kill, if I get one kill, I will be happy. That's. It's, it, it, no. There we go. Yes, gotcha. And again. One decent smash attack, and I think I'll have him. Oh, no! Yes! 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 I got him with the down tilt. Oh, this is just my life now. This is the only way to play Smash Bros. 
from now on. Uh, you know, that's an extremely effective tactic. If you're playing Ridley and you're going up against somebody who happens to be using nothing but a, a single nunchuck, uh, it's a really good tactic to just use the fireballs because they are hard to avoid because you can a shield. And... Uh, 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 no. No. Uh, ah. <laughs> oh, he's throwing my crown off the edge. No, he hasn't. <laughs> I can still punch him, though. And I've got my crown back. Am I going to win this one? It's it's not hugely likely, but it's not seeming as impossible as it as it once was. <laughs> no! Oh, bloody hell, I went and hit C instead of Z. Don't you hate it when you do that? It's just the worst. Getting a bit of lag as well. Ah. Ah. <laughs> it's just as well. It's as, He's as spammy as he is because otherwise... Oh no, no, I can't grab. That's not fair. You're not allowed to use moves I can't. There we go. Oh my god, you do it's not impossible! It's extremely unlikely, but it's not impossible anymore. I could... I could maybe scrape this. And how embarrassing would that be for our player? Oh, god damn, he's taken the one thing that I really love. Uh, gotcha. Come on. Ah! <laughs> yes, yes, crown. No. No! Oh, God. That was a lot closer than I thought it was ever going to be. <laughs> oh, my lordy Lou. But there you go. It proves it can be done. You can play with an unchuck online. Are they going to say anything? No, I didn't think so. <laughs> Just say, you suck, mate. And I was going to can't, can't even tell them. How close they came to being beaten by somebody using nothing but a wee nunchuck. So there you have it. Probably the least practical way to play Smash online, but actually be able to properly do it and come very close to winning using this lovely device here. Uh, if you want to pick one up yourself for this, or if you do just want to use a GameCube controller, just a single one, then yeah, check it out in the link in the description. Why not? Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then why don't you find some other ludicrously impractical way to play with that subscribe button and be sure to check out nintendolife.com for all sorts of lovely Nintendo-related content. Thank you again for watching. Bye-bye. Oh,